Hello guys. How are you doing? Maria. We're going to go to the dashboard. Hi, Maria. How are you? Good evening. Hello, Mercy. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Hi, Anna. Hi. How are you doing? Uh, this was great. Okay, good. Hey, I'm having a problem with the um, with the platform. Okay. It doesn't want to work. Something is going on. Okay, so today we have the topic. No. Is the section section four, right? Yes, sir. Sure. Okay. I'm going to share the, the image here with you. Okay, so we have the first one, which is by the end of this class, you will learn how to use condition. No, no, no. Here. Okay, in this class, we'll be exposed to an audio where examples of past, present, and future tense are used. Okay, so this is, for example, the, the combination, right, of these three uh, tenses. Um, I don't know what happened. Do you have any problems with your um uh... I think that do you have problems to access to your platform? No. What do you say, teacher? Is your platform I don't have any I don't have any problem. You don't have the platform? Mm -hmm. yeah. No. I, I can see, see the... the... No, uh, but in your computer, you're in your... 
platform is okay. You can open it. I can open it. It works. I can see the videos. You can't or you can? Mm -hmm. I can't. Okay, but only today? Mm, yes. Yeah, because I'm having a problem. I cannot see the, the videos either. In my case, I don't have a problem. I can see the video. You can see it? Yes. Okay, yeah, because in my case, it's not possible. I've been uh, reloading it, but the videos. Okay, look, I've been trying to fix it, but it's not working. Okay. So, but then uh, probably we'll fix it. They will fix the platform later. So then let me. Okay, so the topic is. Time. Uh, past, present, and future tense. Exactly. Let me show you something that I have here. Hopefully. Anything wrong with with uh, with this? Okay, so then you have the simple the simple past. Okay, so that you can use the present. And let me use let me swap the internet. Maybe the internet also uh, helps. Do you have problems with that, that form? Yes. Uh, uh, why uh, uh, my platform is good? You you can come from share screen. Sure. Let me let me try to open it. <laughs> oh, okay. Right now. Yeah, because the video is not running. Okay. Uh, okay, okay. Let me check. Intermediate. Now I'm going to share. Here we go. Now ah, you're sharing that. Yes, yes. Yeah, but uh, the first is here. No. Next for uh, number one, but here the conversation. Hey, I cannot see your. Uh -huh. It says that, for example, if it is conversation, this neighborhood mm -hmm. has changed. Yes. Neighborhood has changed. Do you have reason, though? What problem with, with video? Mm -hmm. Yes. But, video but it's on, on, only the video. Yes, only the video. All people, that's the problem. Yes. Okay, the rest of the okay. exercises, I can see them. Yes. There is no problem. It's only that one. Mm -hmm. Yes. I think they have to, uh, there must be something in the, uh, that they have to fix 
this is what they call in English a glitch. Okay. See, maybe it's for the problem with internet. Maybe. Yes, That's because true. I have problem with internet too. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, could be. It's possible. I'm going to change it in this moment. Let's see. I'm going to use a different uh, Wi-Fi. Okay, but remember that we're going to look at these sentences. They say before uh, match the phrases. We have the appropriate information. Say before the automobile, people used to stop. And we're going to now. I'm going to try to fix it with this. Okay, I guess that we, let's see if it works now. The platform don't work because- Yeah, uh, somebody was writing in the chat from the other group that uh, her platform is not working, but I don't know if, If it is the same problem, or it's just a, what they call in English is a glitch. Okay, a glitch is something, uh, a problem that happens sometimes, and in the end, you don't know what happened. <laughs> you don't know exactly yes. what what the problem was. Okay, so when we have, for example, uh, expressions with the past, present, and future tenses, also let me see with. Uh, Yes, now, yeah, Google is working now. I have, I have, a, excuse me, teacher. Yes. I have, I, 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 I take a screen, a screen. A screenshot? Screen. Yes, maybe uh -huh. I, I, I can share it. Please, please share it. Yes. Okay, I'm going to say here. Uh, share it in the in the chat. No, sharing sharing the the, the, you should... the 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 part the chat, but only only one part where is uh, explication about uh -huh. the about the time contrast. Okay, good. Uh, can you share in the in the WhatsApp chat? Mm, uh, WhatsApp chat is okay. I'm I'm going to try to be into the WhatsApp first. Okay. Okay. Then in that way we can download it. But okay. it's more easy. Mm -hmm. uh, screen, screen. Uh, it's more easy screen now in this moment uh, to share. Uh, yes. Okay. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, this is screen okay. here, chair here. Okay. Okay. Yes. I don't know what happened. This is the. 
you can you can see uh, no no we don't i can see you can you can see yeah yes yes you yes, yes, say okay. time contrast time contrast okay uh, it's a past okay now, now i can see it you can okay. yes now yes i can see too but let me see the problem is that i am still Wait. Yeah, the problem that I am still sharing my my screen. Can you uh, reduce yours for a minute? Uh, because... Reduce. Uh -huh. uh, oh, it's okay. Leave it there. Yes. I am still sharing mine. I guess that's why. Okay, but anyways, then let's see the. If you see the the. Uh, Thank you, Herbert. Herbert Shark. Uh, you have the past, the present, and the future, right? Yes. And then you have. It says uh, a few years ago, not many people lived here. But yeah. what, okay. what you have to pay attention to is the, the, this time expression at the beginning that says a few years ago. Okay, and after that it says these days. Impressive. A few years ago, not many people lived here. Uh, these days, the population is growing so fast. Okay. And in the future, soon, there will be a lot of shopping malls. So the time expressions used in these uh, sentences are important to know that we are talking about the, the tense. A few years ago, uh, these days is happening now, and soon there will be is for the future. In the second sentence, people used to shop. People used to shop at grocery stores. Okay, grocery store that was a uh, used to is a, a routine or yeah. a habit that we had in the past. Okay. Oh, yes. And then now, uh -huh, in the present, you say, today, people shop at supermarkets. Supermarket. Uh -huh. For example, in my case, I remember my mother. My mother used to shop at the market. Markets in the street or markets uh, in a, let's say, in a, in a place right near the, near the neighborhood. But now, mm -hmm. today... We shop, or the majority of the people shop at supermarkets. Okay. Uh, in 20 years, people might buy groceries by computer. Remember that this book, the book that this material is from an old book. Okay. And this was the prediction 20 or 25 years ago. And now, at present, we buy online. Yes. 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 For yeah. example, online, if you uh -huh, you can buy well, you have an application in your cell phone, and yes. then you you order the the food at the supermarket, and then they bring it. Yes. Okay. The so then, that, huh? In the United States, that have that yes. application about this. And here too, you know, if you go to this super yes, in, in this moment, uh -huh, you can do it. Yes. Then. The other sentence below says, uh, in 20 years, people might buy groceries by computer. The last one is, 50 years ago, people walked everywhere. Okay, yeah. walked. Yes. No, we didn't have too many cars. Yes. Nowadays, people drive their cars instead. Okay, and in the future, people are going to use cars even more. And that is true. Uh, 10 years ago, here in Los Chorros, there were like 25,000 cars a day. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, then uh, like five, no, 
That was 15 years ago, 25. 10 years ago, there were uh, like 40,000 cars a day. Okay. And five years ago, there were like 60,000 cars a day only in the stores. And now wow. I don't now I don't know. Yeah. Okay, but imagine how the traffic in cars are increasing and mm -hmm. there is no and but individual cars. Okay, yes. we don't have a good uh, transportation system. Okay. Yes. We need a good transportation system. We don't need more streets. Okay, yes. because with more streets, we only kill the the environment, right? So we need more yeah. we need more uh more a, pollution. Uh -huh, exactly, that's more pollution. Yeah, more pollution. So we get uh, we need a good good system of transportation, good buses, a nice train, okay, a metro, something like that, a subway. Okay, it would yeah. work. Okay, now uh, go uh, scroll down, please, uh, Ed, uh Herbert. Okay, time yeah. constraints, it says, help us to talk about perhaps a same situation that we have lived, okay? Now, go back again, up. Uh, uh, scroll up, uh, yes, okay. scroll up. Okay, there. Then you say, for example, the same situation in different moments. In the past, a few years ago, not many people lived here. Uh, yes. Nowadays, this the, these days, the population is growing so fast. Here in Lower Des, when I came to live here, there were in the neighborhood where I live, there were five hundred yeah. houses. Five hundred. Uh, these days, there are one thousand houses. Okay. Uh, probably in the future, there will be maybe one thousand five hundred houses so then so the the houses the people the population is also increasing okay that's why the time contrast is the same situation in the past now the same situation the same event uh, same situation but with a difference and now and in the future no problem okay, no problem. Yeah. Yeah. okay. good so if you want a uh, scroll down, Hector, I want to see the Hector. I said good. Herber. Okay, this this one is say more time expressions. You have, for example, at that time in the past, then Thanks. present is currently. Nowadays, and in the meantime, now, okay, uh, these days. Today, okay, these are all the ones. Um, and in the future, um, in the next couple of years, uh, in the next, in the near future, uh, soon, uh, let me see, uh, for example, uh, maybe in a, in, a, in a few years time, also you can use these different types. Okay, Herbert, thank you very much. Okay, okay so then, uh, now, as a child, yes. Mm -hmm. Let me see okay. here. Yes, give me. Okay, do you have any questions? No? Mm, no. Okay. Who wants to give me an example? Okay. Who wants to give me an example using mm. a... an event that happened, that, how your life was in the past, how it is now, and how it could be in the future? Mm. Uh, uh, maybe 20 years ago, people 
uh, watching uh, watch uh, for uh, no no machine mm -hmm. no machine is, is not uh, lavadero no sé cómo lavadero en inglés uh, just what yes lavadero uh, ah the bowls uh -huh, bowls the bowls ah uh -huh. sí maybe twenty years ago people watched uh, bowl okay Okay, good. Now, uh, can you stop your sharing, please, um, Herbert? Okay, okay. Thank you, just let me, because I want to. Okay. That is mine, right? Is that yours? Yes, but I... Okay, let me see. I can I think I can do it from here. You can hear, you can see. Let's see, yes. Yes, okay. Okay. Okay, now can you stop yours? No. Uh, you can you can see the the. Yeah, but uh, but uh, I need to share mine, so I, that's what I want you to. Can you close yours? Close. Uh huh. Okay. Uh... Okay. Here we go. Good. Okay, because now in this moment, I want you to write in the chat, for example, the events that happened to you. For example, uh, as a child, I'm going to write here in the chat some ideas. As a child, I used to play in the street. Yeah. Okay. Then, uh, now, I played in private uh, soccer, soccer pits, okay? Now okay. I play in soccer pits, okay? Um, in a maybe in the near future, I will play. A, let me see. In uh, I will play virtually. Okay, now please write in the chat something that you that happened to you in the past, something that have changed now, and what you expect in the future.
As a child, I used to play. I used to play with my friends in the street near my house. Okay. Try to follow the sequence, okay? Okay, this is something probably um, about the economical situation. Look at this. In the past, we struggled financially during the early years of our business. If you had a business, right? And in the present, sometimes with a strategic planning, our financial situation has significantly improved, okay? Okay, write your sentences. Share, share your sentences. Bring another one. In near future, the big companies will will have will have a virtual manager. Uh huh. Yes, I'm talking about the artificial intelligence, okay, AI, yes? It's possible, it's possible, Luis Miguel. Ya se puede, teacher. Ah? Ya se puede, o el video, creo. Okay, let me. Oh, yes, you're right. Yes, I can see it now. Okay, a few years ago, I went, I, I will show you that in a minute. A few years ago, I went to the park, uh, to the park, but now I go to the gym. 10 years ago, I used to play softball at school. Now I play soft um, on a softball team. In the near future, I'll be a coach. Okay, Mercy, that's nice. Is it true, Mercy? Mercy, is that true? Teacher, Mercy is trying to but... She can't, right? May yes. Maybe she can't. Uh -huh, yes, it must be a, an issue with the microphone. I know. Thank you. Okay.
Let me show you now when. I'm gonna give you one very simple, very practical. Uh, when I was a child, I used to watch a lot of movies every day. Now I rarely watch movies in my free time. Soon I could use my free time for other things. For example, work, shopping. Hey, very nice, Kenya. Very, very nice. Congrats. Okay, good. I just uh, only wore casual clothes, and now that I'm older, I only wear formal clothes. That happens too. Okay, good. Very nice. You see, this one is another one uh, simple, and I am present. I am a student, fast. Last year, I was in a different school. And in the future, next semester, I will be studying new subjects, right? That could be another one. Okay, this one is related to, to the time. For example, uh, I am right now I am studying English, right? Yesterday at this time, I was watching a movie. Uh, tomorrow at 3 p.m. or at this time, I would be attending a language class. So the, the sequence is the, the time, right? At this time, right now, tomorrow three. Okay, so you see there is always a point that connects the ideas. Okay, now let's see the. The platform. Right and see if we can. Watch the video. Okay, I'm going to share the audio. Now let's watch. Hello and welcome back. We're about to listen to different tenses in a single conversation. Pay attention and try to identify the tenses they are using. This neighborhood has changed. Part A. Listen and practice. This neighborhood sure has changed. I know. A few years ago, not many people lived here, but the population is growing so fast these days. Yeah, it seems like there's a construction site on every corner. Remember how we used to buy candy at that little grocery store? Now it's a multiplex cinema. Yeah, and they're tearing down our high school. They're going to build a shopping mall. Soon there will be just malls and parking lots. That's because everyone has a car. Fifty years ago, people walked everywhere. 
Nowadays, they drive. Listen to the rest of the conversation. Okay. Now, can you see it? Yes. Okay, then uh, let me see. Luis Miguel, you are going to be Matt. And Rebecca, you are going to be Tania. Could you please read the conversation? Okay. Okay, this neighborhood sure has shame. I know. A few years ago, not, ma not many people live here, but the population is growing no so fast this day. Yeah, it seems like there is a construction sit on every corner. Remember how we to buy candy at the little grocery store? Now is a multiplex cinema. Yeah, and they are tearing down our high school. They are going to build a shopping mile soon. Mm. Will be just malls and parking lots. That's because everyone has a car. 50 years ago, people working every, everywhere. No, no one, how do you say nowadays? Nowadays, correct. Yes, nowadays. Nowadays, they drive. Nowadays. Okay, nowadays, they drive. Okay, what any is nowadays? Now, today, today. Okay. yes, today. Okay. At present. Okay, uh, do you have any other questions about the vocabulary? No problem yeah, with the vocabulary? Tearing down. Which one? Tearing down. Oh, tearing down is uh, they are the, the, the demolition when they are going to uh, destroy, destroy the place, right? Oh, okay. Uh -huh. That is tearing down. Demolition. What else? Okay, in, as you can see in this um, this conversation is, uh, for example, has changed. For example, if you see many, many places uh, have changed since we were, uh, for example, a, a, let's say that kids when we were children, right? Because yes. I remember, uh, my name, I remember Ciudad Delgado, for example. I used to live in Ciudad Delgado when I was a child, and this city was was very nice. Then uh, after that, I came back to see to visit some friends, and the city was very different. Okay, the there were more uh, more houses in the streets near the streets. Uh, other neighborhoods, uh, they had a, uh, for example, change the, 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 for example, the some places were not there anymore. So there were other buildings, other houses. So then there were a lot of changes in that place, right? So then everything changes, right? Everything changes in the, in life. The house, the, your house. Has your house changed? Have you changed your house in the last uh, 10, 15 years? No? No, teacher. Mm. Nothing? Or your or your bathroom, for example, that you change it? Some in things? My neighborhood. Uh-huh. Uh it changed. What is your neighborhood, Anna? Uh, the... El Pepeto. <laughs> okay, uh huh. Yes. Has uh, because uh, many people that I knew mm -hmm. is gone. Okay. Uh -huh. Yes, that's a, that's a difference too. 
Okay, for example, you know that when you go to a place, you look different because you don't see the same people, right? So then even uh, an old job that you had, when you go to that place again, then you see that, you know, it's, uh, it's different, right? Okay, good. It's not a new, new neighbor. <laughs> uh-huh, exactly. Okay. What else has changed in their neighborhood? Say, what else has changed in their neighborhood? Well, what about that old book store? Do you know if it's still there? No, it's not. Now it's a pizza. Korea. Really? Let's go check it out. All this talk about change is making me hungry. Did you get the tenses? Did you notice how they used simple past alone with present and future? Stay with us so you can learn to do the same. Okay. Now, here you go, so it will be able to describe events using time contrast. Now, let's see this one. This is what you were doing. Felt, uh, uh, I felt the uh, every time uh, it's more difficult. <laughs> what? The, the information, because uh, when, when I had to uh, put a uh, um, practice. <laughs> I forget <laughs> the rulers. <laughs> ah, okay. No, uh, yeah, it's how can I show this? It's normal because uh, you need to when it, when you have a new topic, new information. Sometimes it's not easy to assimilate and to produce. Uh, the sentence perfectly. Probably in the class you can do it, but tomorrow when you are alone or when you come back to the class, probably you will forget some details, but that is uh, because you need to, I mean, you really need to practice a lot. Then uh, it's normal that you feel that it's difficult to practice, that you forget some rules. Uh, that's normal, but you have to practice. And it's good it's good that you that you feel that in this moment because uh, this is intermediate level, but every level that you go up, you are going to feel more and more and more complex, right? Because yeah. there, will, there will be more structures, different forms. Then you have, you will see the passive voice, then the conditionals, then the uh, mixed conditional. Then there will be so. Then now in this moment. You have to get everything in this moment, right? And then not to not to leave uh, lagoons, okay, gaps, okay, in your in your mind, in your knowledge, okay. You have to try to remember eighty or ninety percent of the course for the next one, okay. So then I know it's a it's a big effort, okay, that you have to make. Everybody has to make. But uh, but it's, it's it's worth it, right? It's worth it. Yeah, then you will feel that. But uh, you know, it, that's that's the point, right? The practice, practice, practice makes perfect. Now listen to this video. It's a continuation of the other one, and now you will see, for example, a practical way to use the time contrast. On your verbs, think about it as one sentence per tense. We will now give you more time expressions that you may use with each expressions that you Hello everyone, before you watch our video, we want you to write on our discussion box expressions that you already know, which are used in the past, present and future. Time contrasts. Past. A few years ago, not many people lived here. Present. 
These days, the population is growing so fast. Future Soon, there will be a lot of shopping malls. People used to shop at grocery stores. Today, people shop at supermarkets. In 20 years, people might buy groceries by computer. 50 years ago, people walked everywhere. Nowadays, people drive their cars instead. In the future, people are going to use cars even more. We noticed you wrote some time expressions related to past, present, and future. Well done. Now let's talk a bit about time contrast. This helps us to talk about perhaps a same situation that we have lived over the years and we want to make reference since it happened, taking it to our present and imagining it in a future. The trick here is for us to use verbs properly in its right tense along with time expressions. Let's go over the chart. In the first column we talk about past and we use time expressions like a few years ago or people used to or 50 years ago and our verbs are in past. We used lived and walked. Let's move on to the present and here we use these days, today or nowadays and of course our verbs are is growing, shop and drive which are in the present. Last but not least we have our future using expressions such as soon, in 20 years, in the future. Therefore we use verbs in future, will be, might buy, are going to use. Time contrast is easy to use, just double check on your verbs. Think about it as one sentence per tense. We will now give you more time expressions that you may use with each tense. Past expressions. At that time, in the past, then. Present expressions. Currently, in the meantime, now. Future expressions. In the next couple of years, next in the near future. Now we want you to write a short description about how has your life changed using the expressions below. Make sure you do it and present it to your teacher to make sure you did it right. Okay, those were the sentences sentences that you were writing in the, in the chat. Now there's a practice here. Okay, that goes for uh, match the phrases with the appropriate information. So before the automobile, okay, what? People dying travel has much, has much from city to city. Okay. Good. And before there were supermarkets, people used to shop at small stores. The first one. The first one, yes. Thank you. About 500 years ago. About play, 500. Uh-huh. People played the first day of golf. People played the first... Um, people played the first game the of first golf. Game of okay. Um, in most offices today... People work more than... 40 hours a week. More than 40 hours a week? Okay, yeah. In many cities nowadays, pollution is coming. Pollution is becoming more serious, or a serious problem. A serious problem. Soon. Soon. 
Most people are going to work at home. Okay. And in the next hundred years, Doctor, my find a cure for for the common cold. Doctors might find a cure for the common cold. And the last one. Sometimes in the future. There will probably be cities and space. Be cities and space. Okay, there you go. All of them right. So you have here the present, past, and the future. Okay, do you have any questions about this exercise? Okay, this is what we are going to have. Uh, let's say in this class, you will notice the practice and intonation and the statements beginning with a time phrase. Also at the end of the class, you will have time to practice and personalize phrases using different tenses. Okay. Uh, this is, wait a minute. Another document. Okay, good. Uh, this has been. Okay, I'm just going to. Okay, uh, for tomorrow, please uh, think about some uh, actions, activities, and verbs in the past. We are going to, to work on that. And you are going, for example, to like kind of narrate stories of events that happened to, that happened to you, but um, a, in the past, right? For example, the when you started with something, then what happened after, and then in the end, what was the the result, right? In the future, or what is your expectation? For example, you know, little story. I I when I was a child, uh, I used to go to, I used to play in the. I used to no. I used to go to the to the cinema, okay, uh, downtown, okay, to watch movies in the cine in the in the cinema. Now, I only watch movies on um, different platforms, okay. That you have, uh, for example, uh, Netflix. Uh, you have Amazon and all those platforms, right? What do you think is going to be in the future? In the past, we went to the movies. Now you can watch uh, the movies in your house, and you know, with uh, probably in in the future, uh, maybe we will be watch a movie in holograms. Maybe maybe yeah, it could be that could be something that more more realistic. Or or augmented reality you know with those glasses 
In classes. Uh -huh. Aha, Brian. You will feel that you BH, are in... BH. BH. No. Ah, I don't yeah. remember. I don't remember. BH. Uh, BH. I don't remember. The, the, three, the 360. Uh -huh. yes, yes. BC, BCR? No. BCR, maybe. BCR, maybe. right? I think, yeah. Yes, that's the one. Okay. Well, let me check the attendance, right? The attendance we have today. Amanda Yamilet is here. No. Not today. No, but Amanda was here, right? I think I saw her. Okay. Ana Beatriz, yes. Yes, Dayanara is here. Mercy is here. Uh, Angel, Angel Zag is not here. Byron, Giovanni. Here yes, here you are. Cesar, Ivan. Cesar, yes, he's here. Dennis Aronai, Dennis. Yes, Mer yeah, Mercy, no problem. Dennis Herbert Present. is here. Yes, Herbert is here. Juan Carlos. Present teacher. Yes, you are. Catherine Johanna. No. Kenya Yamilet. Yes, is here. here. Luis Miguel is here. I'm here. Maria Delmi. I'm here. Here, there, yes. Martin de Jesus. Jesus, no. Okay, Nuria Sarai, Rebecca Abigail. Yes, teacher. It's not, it's not here. Ah, yes, yes, she's here. And then we have a Stephanie Jamilet. Oh, this is Kenya Jamilet, is there. You know, Stephanie is not attending anymore. Okay, very good. Then uh, don't forget, right, to practice past, present, and future events, right? Using time expressions as a child, uh, before, nowadays, then, as soon as, soon, uh, all the expressions that you have also in the video. I'm going to, to send you a document tomorrow about time expressions in the chat so that you can also have some other ideas to speak tomorrow, okay? Okay, okay. people, thank you very much. That's all for today. Sorry for the inconveniences. Thank you, Herbert, for the support. Okay. Uh, the, Herbert, today was the technical support. Okay. And teacher assistant. He's a, he's a geek. geek. Yeah. Man. Yes, he is. He's a geek. Okay. Very good. Good night, Excellent. everybody. Good night, everybody. Take care. Okay. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye, Denara. Good night. Good night.